Hello everybody, Martin Moncayo here, the e-commerce underdog, and today I'm going to show you how you can send bulk emails to your email list using GetResponse. Okay, so first you have to log in into your GetResponse account, and if you don't have GetResponse yet, I will leave the link in the description for you to have a 30-day free trial to, you know, learn about this platform and use it for your business. It's a great tool. Very affordable. Okay, so once you log in into your GetResponse account, you will get to the dashboard that looks like this. And in here, you have to go to create, then create a newsletter. Okay, and in here, you will have to put the subject line. Okay, drag and drop is better for visuals so that you can see what is, how is your email going to look like. But in here, you just have to put the name of the email that you selected. I already prepared my email. Uh, in Word, so I don't waste time, okay, writing in here. But uh, since I'm going to give a free affiliate marketing training for the people that are in other lists of my email list, I think it's a great subject line. Remember that the subject line is extremely important because it's the thing that is going to make people either click and read the rest of your email or not. So you have to really think what is going to make people read your email. In this case, since it is a free email, affiliate marketing training that I just set up, I think it's a good headline or subject line. So I will go ahead with that. Then you just have to click here, next step. And in get response, you can have, you know, you have different options. You can either pick a template, which I don't recommend, okay? But you can have a template, you know, make it look nice. But uh, this is something the best marketers in the world do. And they usually just go with a bland template, you know, with the text, maybe an image. So you have to keep it simple and model how the guys, the big guys, the big affiliate marketers, the big email marketers are doing it. Okay, so just go with that. Then, uh, as you can see here, you have a preheader, text block, image block. Uh, but... I like to go with the text block and maybe sometimes when I need to put, include a new image, I do it. But since I already have all my text here, I will just go ahead and copy text. This is just an invitation for uh, this new affiliate marketing training that I set it up. You can find the link in the description if you want to be part as well. But, uh, okay, that's it. Then. I want to include two links in this email. So this is one of the links, okay? The URL is this one that I already have prepared, is the registration link for this training. And I also, something that I like to do is to put the colors of my, of my brand. That's why I have this ready, to put the colors of my brand. So if your brand is red, you would like to put the links that color, yellow, yellow. Mine is blue, and that's why I use it. Uh, and let's do the same with the other link that I set it up that is going at the bottom, you know, in the PS section. Okay, uh, let's make it uh, bulk. And now I normally like to... Uh, we have to include the link as well here. I was forgetting. Uh, very important to put your links. And uh, a font that I like to use in my emails, and you can use any of these fonts, is Verdana. Okay, and I like to put the font in number 14. And now I have my email, okay, ready to go. I just have to put, you know, always try to make it personally. Your email list is it has to be full of real people. Don't look at your email list as an, just numbers. Look them as real people who have problems, who uh, are looking for solution, and that this email might be the, the answer they were looking for. So always think in that way. Personalize your emails. Now it is ready to go, okay? And something that I recommend you to do if you use GetResponse to get to the, your subscribers' inbox is to go here to plain text. This is something Franklin Hatchett uh, taught me in one of his trainings. And go here to HTML to plain, wrap long lines, and close. This is something I do in every email that I send, okay? 
close now you have to go to the next step okay and in here you will have to pick uh, the people that you want to send this email to okay and you know these people that are here in the WWS free value training are people who are already in this training so I will not send this email to them and that why, that's why it's important for you to segment your list because sometimes you will have people interested in a specific product, a specific niche, a different topic maybe in the health industry so you don't want to mix everything up and if these people are already in the training it will be a very dumb idea to send this training to them so I have to pick this other email list okay uh, from people who uh, doesn't know about this training that I just set up okay let's see how many people we have here 125 people okay let's continue with the next step uh, and in here it's always good to uh, click the inbox preview because it will show you if how your email will look in Hotmail, Gmail, uh, Owl. It's good to have that. It is. It helps you, you know, in your deliverability. It helps you in the how you get to the inbox of people. Okay, I have this ready to go. And whenever you are going to send an email in GetResponse, you have three options. Either you can send it right away. If it's something urgent that you are sending people, it is good to send it right away. If not, you can schedule your email. Maybe you want it to send them tomorrow, uh, in the morning, in the afternoon, at night. You know, depends on you. You can schedule your email or you can click in perfect timing. Perfect timing means uh, that the email is going to be sent to that specific subscriber uh, at the most convenient time for them. Okay, at the time that person checks their email most uh, regularly. Okay, so if that person checks their email at 8 in the morning, the email is going to be sent at that time. If that person who is in your email is check out their email at uh, 8 p.m., it will send it at, at that time. So this is a great tool. I recommend you to use it a lot. For this time, I will use perfect timing. Okay, and this will delay the the time that you send all the emails because it will send in the best time for each specific email subscriber okay and finally you just have to click here in send okay so that's what we are going to do click send that's it after you send your email you will have 60 seconds to cancel the sending if you uh, remember something that you didn't want it to send right away if not you can just send it and you know it's very simple this is very convenient whenever you're starting to grow your business this is the lifeblood of your business is your online the most important asset any online business can have and you know i've been using get response for a couple of months now i'm very happy with the service with the customer service how easy it is to use you saw how easy it is to prepare an email and send it to a lot of people so I encourage you to check it out if you don't have an email autoresponder or if you have one but you are not happy I encourage you to have the 30-day free trial. And I also want to invite you to this four-day free training that I just sent to these 125 people. This is something I set up on my website with my mentor Sebastian Gomez. You know it covers how to start online with affiliate marketing, how to do email marketing the right way and also sales funnels. It is a four-day mastermind that has a lot of value you are going to learn a lot and it's completely free so i invite you to join i will also leave the link in the description and just before i go i want to invite you to subscribe to my youtube channel i'm making videos every single day i'm also making tutorials and that will help you start online so uh, i would love if you subscribe if you give it a like and with nothing more to say remember keep moving keep grinding keep making things happen and i'll see you in the next one